What's up, y'all? It's a boy, Spidey Studios here, and today we are here with a brand new reaction for the channel. This is a new trailer to My Adventures with Superman. So, guys, uh, full disclosure, um, I did see Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse uh, Saturday. Um, uh, I saw it with Tesher, uh, co-Casper, and uh, we were supposed to do a review of it yesterday, but uh, he was busy, so... Hopefully some point when he comes over this week, we will dig it a review for y'all um, because there's a lot to talk about with that movie. But all you need to know is I fucking loved it. It was the best Spider-Man movie to date and probably the best one ever. I still think No Way Home personally is, a, is the best Spider-Man movie um, in live action, um, honestly, with all three Spider-Mans and the great storytelling of Tom Holland's Spider-Man. But, um, but yeah, this was so much better. But let me stop before I get too off track so like i said before so this superman show has a very interesting track record in the sense of what it was supposed to like i guess supposed to like mean if you get with my gist is basically i believe the superman show was announced to come on the dc universe app when that was a thing then when all of the dc projects transferred from that to hbo max i think the show was supposed to go there but it never did. And I guess there were rumors that we thought the show was canceled or was not gonna get picked up or something. Um, but then all of a sudden, uh, they made an announcement that it was still coming and that Huey, who's Jack Quid, is playing Superman. And he's supposed to um, play Superman in the show. Apparently this show, along with the new Batman animated series that's supposed to come out, the Batman animated series that was supposed to come out and Kevin Conroy was supposed to voice, unfortunately, won't happen. But I think the show's still going to happen. He That show was moved to um, Amazon. This show was moved to Adult Swim. Now, I assume they already finished the first season before it moved to Adult Swim. So by the next season, if the show does get a next season, it will be um, a bit more mature, possibly. Which I am curious. I like the animation style from what I remember from the last trailer. I like the animation style. It was very much Invincible. It reminded me of Invincible a lot. So I'm really excited. I heard a little bit of voices, but not that much. But I think that the voices were pretty decent. So hopefully, since this is a longer trailer, we'll be able to see and hear more of the voices and see more of the animation and see a cool glimpse of the story. So that's all I want. Story, characters, voice acting, and looks of characters is what I want from this. So, without further ado, I just want to see what they gave us, so without further ado, we are starting. Huh. Oh. I can do this. I'm gonna hide my powers and be a normal man having a normal day. Hang on. Starting now. Huh? Don't. Everyone thinks they know the Man of Steel. Ah! But you've never seen the son of jor like this before. Who am I? What was that? Superman! I'd like to interview you for the Daily Planet. Uh, sorry, no comment. What was it? These are the new interns. I want you to show them the ropes and get... They can help me with the story. If we break this, we'll become real reporters. <laughs> this is the story of the century! Who is Superman? Lois, I know what Superman is. Huh? You think he's a plane? <laughs> it kind of looks like a bird. My Adventures with Superman, two episode series premiere, Thursday, July 6th at midnight on Adult Swim. Next day on Max. Okay. Oh, that's cool. It gives you. I like. I like that they started doing that. Now they give you comics to read uh, that might have been inspired for, by the show. Okay, so that was a lot. That was a lot given. So. It kind of now gives me a little bit of a modern version of Lois and Clark, The Adventures of Superman, a little bit. A little bit. It gave me a little bit of a modern take of that. Um, I like the animation. I like the voice acting. I think the character designs are still... Clark looks great. Lois and Jimmy... You know my feelings towards that. They look obviously unrecognizable. But I still think that the actors sound really good they sound like their characters so i'm willing to excuse it if it's good um but yeah i like it i like the animation style i like the character designs i like the voice acting for all the characters so far and it kind of reminds me of superman year one a little bit which i like 
Um, <laughs> I thought that was funny that he just broke his clock by tapping it. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, so jogging kind of reminds me of the Superman animated series uh, where he was uh, Clark was bike riding one in one episode, I think. But it reminds me of the Superman animated series where he was doing that. So here's my question. So Lois here, does Lois know that Clark is Superman? Because he's flying with the glasses and everything. So I'm assuming how this is going to go. Clark is probably going to be... How do I explain? He's going to be, like, you know, keeping his secret identity for, like, a good chunk of the season. And then probably, like, either in the middle or towards the end of the season, Lois finds out. And then they're, like, a crime-fighting duo together, sort of, maybe. But it seemed like, from what it says, Lois is not a reporter. And both Jimmy and Clark were the new interns. Because Jim, and usually how it is, Lois and Jimmy have already been working there for a while, and then Clark shows up. But no, it looks like both Clark and Jimmy are interns, and Lois isn't a reporter yet. But if they break the Superman story, it makes them official reporters. Which is interesting. I'd like to see how that goes. I'm curious about that. But I do like all the voice acting. I do like the animation for this. It's really good. I wonder how long. And I like this outfit that he's wearing. Like, it's just a jacket and hoodie. But I like the flight animations. I love the, the, the action sequences. They look really good. I like all of this. Action looks good. Animation looks good. It looks like Invincible. And I like it. For a Superman show, it makes sense. I like his suit. But like I said, like I said earlier... Uh, in the last trailer, his S is just unrecognizable. I can't tell that's what his S looks I can't tell that it looks like an S. That's just me. I can't tell that it looks like an S, but I do like the animation a lot. But this looks like it's going to be fun. This looks like going to be a fun Superman show. So I'm excited to see that. Yeah, I'm excited for this. It looks like a fun, fun Superman story. Now they said... It's going to be a two-episode premiere that's going to drop July 6th at midnight. But then it will release the next day on HBO Max. So probably what I'll do is I'll watch it the day after it comes out. And when it's on HBO Max, I will, uh, or just Max, whatever, I'm going to uh, watch it then. Because I'm really excited for that. Because I, I saw the comments when I saw my first video. And then the comments of the video, the first trailer. We haven't had a Superman animated series since the animated series of Superman. And that was in like the 90s. That was in like the late 90s. So we haven't had a Superman animated series since the late 90s. That's crazy to think about. Because every single version of Superman that we've seen, he's either teamed up with Batman or teamed up in a Justice League animated movie or an animated show. And in the movies we've seen him, but not that much either. So I find that interesting that we haven't had a Superman animated series since the late 90s. Which is funny to think about, but I'm glad we're getting one. It's been a while. Like, yeah, we've had live-action Superman shows to make up for it, but, like, I think there's a lot more you could do with animation than you can do with live-action. Even though I'm loving Superman and Lois right now, Superman and Lois is, like, pinnacle of great Superman storytelling. I'm excited that we're actually getting another Superman animated series. So I am curious how that's going to go, but, yeah, man. Sounds like a bunch of great stuff. I'm really excited for this. So, I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction to that. Sorry, looking at stuff to buy. Um, so, I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction to that. If you guys did, let me know in the comments down below what your favorite part of this trailer was and part of this trailer reaction. Do you like this trailer? Are you excited for this interpretation of Superman? Are you excited for anything for Superman-related stuff? This, Superman Lois, Superman Legacy. We're getting a lot of Superman stuff, so... Uh, I'd like to hear you guys' comments and opinions down in the comment section down below. Drop a like on the video for your boy. Hit the subscribe button to be part of the community. And hit bell notifications so you guys know when I shall post next. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.